Got clashing swords, dashing knights, and galloping hooves at the third annual North Dakota Renaissance Fair. And that's where we find the Valley Today's Tatum Miller this morning, live at the North Dakota Horse Park, getting a sneak peek of jesters, jousters, and everything mm -hmm. medieval. Good morrow, Tatum. Go, go in front of them, Natalie. Back them up. Good morrow, Alex. That's right. I'm here live at the North Dakota Renaissance Fair, and we made a bit of a relocation. We are now inside one of the tents where they host some of their live performances. I'm here live with Amanda Panino, who is one of the performers here, and you are in a chandelier right now. I am. <laughs> so I what am. do you do in these performances? There's a lot of different acts. All of our artists perform many different talents. Um, I don't want to give away too much because I feel like our audience should come out and see our show tonight. We have a special offer, which is $12 tickets. It's one of a kind experience. So I highly recommend the Fargo community and area to come and check out the Cirque Museo show. So we have trick riding, we have bareback riding, uh, we have hula hoops, we have dance, we have uh, hand balancing. It's amazing what our artists do. Yeah, that sounds incredible. And yeah. I know we have one of our friends that's going to be in the show tonight. Yes. So yes. who is this? This is Guido. He is a 21-year-old Suffolk Punched. This is his retirement year. So I highly recommend anyone in the area that loves horses or is interested in horses to come out and check out our wonderful variety of horses that we have. And also with that, they can see Guido with a VIP backstage tour here with Ooh. Cirque Maceo and they get to check out all of our horses. Traveling horses are wonderful superstars, but Guido here is definitely fabulous and one of a kind and he was made for the camera. I can tell he started the show. Yeah. <laughs> now he doesn't have his full costume on, but you do. Yes, so, I do. One of the most unique things about Renaissance Fairs is people dress up and get integrated into yes. this. So tell me about what you're wearing. So this is what you would call your garb. So when you're at a Renaissance Fair, you can wear costumes, but you can call it garb. They wear leathers, uh, long skirts, uh, all types of clothing material. Um, but our Renaissance artists and performers, they really get into touch with their, their character. Um, but you could come as yourself, and then maybe you'll find, you know, who you might, your other person might be yeah. um, at a Renaissance Fair. But our audience should come and check it out. It's this weekend and next weekend from 10 to 5.30 at the North Dakota um, Equestrian Park. Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, the Renaissance Fair, we've got turkey legs, we've got shows, we've got jousting, all kinds yes, of things. you've got beautiful grounds. And my last question, where can we find tickets? You could find tickets at ndrenaissancefairwithane.com. Um, that's where our tickets can be. And then we have, uh, if you see got the scan that you could just scan with your phone. Yeah. That is amazing. Oh, well, thank yeah. you so much for joining us, yeah. Amanda. Thank me you. and my new best friend are going to take a couple laps around here, but we'll check in with you one more time. I'm Tata Miller for Valley News Live. Back to you at the studio, Alex. <laughs> awesome. Thank you so much, Tata. Well, remember the Renaissance Fair runs June 15th and 16th, and then again June 22nd and 23rd at the North Dakota Horse Park.